UFO is the fourth expansion in the MetaZoo TCG, and today we are going to be opening up an entire UFO booster box, and I'm going to be sharing my initial reactions of this set. I've seen very little of it so far. I have only seen a few of the cards in this set, so I'm excited to experience this with you guys for the first time. Let's go. All right, let's take a quick look at the front here. I would say definitely is probably one of my favorite uh, booster box designs. Might be my favorite. Let's go ahead and uh, break the seal here. Now you can see it even a little bit better without the plastic on it. Some cool things. Got the, the Foo Fighters on there, I guess, or something. Not really sure what's up with that. I've just been seeing stuff on social media. All right. Very, very nice here. Got some pretty cool pack artworks. Let's take a look at those real fast. All right. Now, like I said, I do kind of want to um, be able to react to seeing these cards for the first time, but at the same time, we also want to be able to see kind of what some of our chase cards are, and each set has its own little subset of usually uh, cards that only come in the full hollow. So, in this set, it's called the Supernova 6, and this info can be found at MetaZoo HQ, a really great MetaZoo resource. And these are the cards right here, Flatwoods Monster UFO, Lechuza, the um, Griddle Greaser Pete, Mini T-Rex, and Neutrality Totality. Very fascinating. Let's see if we can get any of those great hits today. All right, if it's like the past few sets, it should be a four card trick, but I guess we'll find out if that's true or not. Yeah, it looks like it, because usually the the rare sort of card appears here. Drowned Sea Orb, that's pretty cool, I like that. Tree Token, Lightning Storm, Flame Aura, Boulder Bash, Flexisto, Flex, Felix, <laughs> Felix Stowe, Fire Demon. Okay. Rising Tides, Stargate Project. That's kind of cool. Got a men in black feel to it. Blue Jet Strike, Giant Space Brains. The Haddock Goblin. Looks like Dobby. Okay, and our uh, hollow, our foil card is a reverse hollow Sherman Bleece. Bleece? Bleece? Beast. Wow, I can't read. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's keep it rolling. Let's see if four card trick is correct. Oh, we actually got a Men in Black card. Very interesting. I'm surprised that that's not a trademark sort of thing, but maybe, I guess the Men in Black movies must be based off of a real sort of thing, I suppose, maybe. Or maybe it is based off of the movie and somehow they are able to get away with doing that. Roo Guru, the Seven Thunders, that one's pretty cool. Blue Jet Strike, Giant Squid, the monster of Partridge Creek and ooh nice okay we well, did get a full hollow static snow stone love the hollow on that want to see if there's any kind of cool little icons in there do we got like a little flying saucer sort of thing anywhere um, probably but I'm not seeing it I do see like kind of like a meteor up there all right very nice get a sleeve on that. Got the Gargantuan Gliders. Friend Token. Aw, oh, that's nice. Lightning Storm, Flame Aura, Charles Mill Lake Monster. Forest Elemental, Peace Offering. Oh man, that's rough. Sherman Beast, Blue Jet Strike, Eye for an Eye. USO. Fascinating. 
wonder what that stands for. Unidentified. Uh, S? What does that stand for? Anyway. Ooh, that's cool. Very cool. Caster gun. Oh, I love the silver on there. That's really cool. All right. With the drowned sea orb again. Blood Moon. That was actually a really nice artwork by Lily. Good job, Lily. I like that. Burnt Out. Merging Flames. <laughs> Featuring the, um, what is that? The Fire Rabbit. Is that what his name is? Old Saybrook's Blockheads. Interesting one. Sky Snake. Nice. Dwarf Star. And, oh, sorry, still got another one. The Goblin again. In reverse, a hold to Saybrook Blockheads. <laughs> well, we don't need to sleep in that one. We won't sleep up the reverse hollows. Frozen Rain Orb. Sleep Token. Oh, Sheep Token. Wow. Wow, I need to learn how to read. Sheep Token. Obviously, that's a sheep on there. Farm. With all the animals getting beamed up. Spirit Aura. Uh, Croco Dingo. Gravity Shift. Rising Tides. Sabertooth Tiger. I like that one too. That's cool. Illustrated by Isaac Sky Lee. Bookmark Blue. Dusk's Omen. USO. And Forest Friends. <laughs> Nice, we got the unicorn. Who's that? Um, Wapalusi, or who's that? And the ghost deer. The forest friends. Interesting, though. I would have assumed that something like this would have come in the wilderness set. I mean, I guess maybe they have to, like, still include a good bit of each type. So that definitely kind of makes it a little bit... Uh, harder to keep on theme, I guess, if you have to like include a little bit of each type, but anyway. Drowned Sea Orb, Cannonball Token, Suburban, Cosmic, Devoid Potion, Mike the Headless Chicken, Blockheads, Sam's Trusty Baseball Bat, <laughs> nice, smacking that alien on the head, Blue Jet Strike, Giant Squid, Reaper's Scythe. Nice, that's a pretty cool one. And, ooh, another full hollow. We're doing pretty well with the full hollow so far. Proctor Valley Monster. Yeah, I just love the MetaZoo hollows. They look really, really nice. Again, I'm just trying to see what little icons are in there. Can't quite make out what's different. Okay, I do see like a, a flying saucer in there. It's really tiny, but it's in there. The card quality on these feel actually really nice. Um, I feel like almost, I don't know if it was for Wilderness or one of the, the more recent sets, maybe it was Crypto Nation 2nd Edition. I feel like the cards felt kind of cheap with the exception of the main foil card. These all feel actually really, really good. Headless Cannoneer. Laser Beam Gun Upgrade. Sabertooth Tiger. Crop Circles. Dwarf Star. White Stag. And Houston Batman. Nice. Houston Batman. Look at that guy, he looks like a gargoyle. Pamela. Pamela Harris. Sheep token. 
Forest Aura, Dozing Off. Uh, Grunch Road Monster, Unwanted Guest. Sky Snake again, Call of the Storm. Null Spell, Reaper Scythe, and... Hey, nice, I believe. Isn't that one of the, uh, the ones you wanna get? Or maybe not, I'm not sure, but it's definitely one of the pack arts. That seems like a, a pretty cool one. How do you even pronounce that? Wakinian? Is this one of the... Is this one of the Supernova 6? No, it's not, but a very nice one to get. We'll take that. Looks like they've got like a little black hole. Can you see that in the center there? That's kind of a, a cool little icon in there. Wakinian? Correct me in the comments below if I'm not pronouncing it correctly. With the Ogula. Nice, that's kind of cool. Like a two headed alien monster. Friend token. Rushing river. Light aura. Earth shattering quake. Mike, the headless chicken. Lightning Spark, Sherman Beast, I don't remember seeing that one, they kind of look like little sloth people things, Aqua Pura, Energy Being, that's another cool one as well, and, oh, sorry, faked you out, the monster of Partridge Creek, and here we go, Frozen Rain Ore, nice, we've been doing pretty well, we got a, quite a lot of full hollows so far. We will definitely take that. If you've gotten a chance to open this, or maybe even just you know view some openings, let me know uh, what your favorite card is from this set. I'm still, of course, very undecided. Maybe by the end of this, I'll have an idea if I pull a, a cool one that I like. Felix, uh, Felix Stowe, Fire Demon, Phantom, Kangaroo. Nice, I like that one too. Trap Springer, Blighted Embers, Lubok, Lubok Lights, Lubok Lights, something like that. Static Halts, and, ooh, very cool, another full hollow Sunset final, Finality Orb. It's kind of cool, I think it's got like a, a hand coming through the, the orb there. Definitely some cool cards, I will say that. All right, we might need to move this out of the way so we can make room for our hits here. So you can see some of them. Hat Man. Nice. I like that. That would be a cool one to get in the hollow. Friends, Blood Moon, Dark Aura. Burnout, Gravity Shift, Laser Beam Gun Upgrade, Terraforming, what is happening in this one? It's like some like red ooze all over the ground. Casablanca Entities, that one's kind of a cool alien one. Giant Squid, White Stang, and Full Hollow Omen Street Orb. I'm having to sleep up a lot of these full hollows, so I'm gonna grab some more of these sleeves out of here. I guess we'll just leave that up there, we'll use it. All right. That one opens nice and buttery. All right, Proctor Valley Monster. Bright Skies, Frost Aura, Dozing Off, Invigorate, Peace Offering, Sabertooth Tiger, Bookmark Blue, Null Spell, Tinfoil Hat, of course, you gotta have a Tinfoil Hat card. And we got Reverse, haven't seen a Reverse in a while, that's kind of a cool one though. The Accordion Teeter, very interesting. Evil wins. Man, that's, that sucks. Uh, 
Lightning Spark, Sherman Beast, Blighted Embers, Giant Space Brains, Resurrection from the Afterlife. We got the Headless Chicken again. Who's back? He's back. We got Pocket Dimension Orb. Getting a lot of these little orb type things. Still looking for those Supernova 6. I don't think we pulled any of them yet. From what I can tell. Gargantuan Gliders. Whoops, dropped one there. What was that? Dwarf Star, and this is a new one I haven't seen yet. Whirling Wimpus. Kind of has a tornadoes look to him, but he's a monkey. And we got Forest Friends again, the full hollow. That's just a nice one. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, this might be my favorite one I've seen so far. I like that. All right. You know what, guys? It is time that we do something different. I think we're gonna do a mega stack. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, we are going to open up a bunch of these and pull out just the hits. And uh, yeah, we'll open it up in one big stack. So what we gotta do, gotta rip it, pull it out. Still gotta do the card trick. And then this should be our hit right here. Stick that down. Put these away. Just make sure we didn't miss anything. All right, good to go. Do it again. And on to our last one here. Rip. Pull it out. Four to the front. And stick our hit there. Just do a quick double check. Hey, there's the Foo Fighters. Nice. I, I told you that that was a card. Nice. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know which came first. The band name or the... Uh, maybe the band was named after something extraterrestrial. All right. Dusk Omen. It's kind of cool. All right. But now we have our mega stack here gonna open our right, sorry we're gonna uncover them one by one and see what hits we get let's find out okay nice we got another full hollow sparky slushy sparky slushy that's something let's say for your own good we recommend you avoid this yellow snow as well okay interesting next up we have water Submergence. Nice. This one's kind of cool as well. We got a lot of the uh, the water cryptids in there. We got Beaver Sharp. We got Chessie. Some others I'm sure that I'm not able to name, but that's cool. I always love the blues on MetaZoo cards. Another Static Snowstone. I think we pulled that one already. Alien Bigfoot. Nice. Nice, they do have a reverse hollow of that one. I love that one. That one's really cool. All right. Static Snowstone Reverse. Hey, nice. Ogula. The two-headed little, uh, looks like Dreadnought, kind of, with two heads. Very nice. Again, love the blues. It's a cool one. We got... Whoops. Yeah, we got another Forest Friends Hollow. Not gonna complain. It's a great card. All right. Full Hollow, the Le uh, Leveland Rocket. Leveland Rocket. Okay, that's kind of cool. Definitely has an alien, like the alien in the movie, look to him. I like it. And. We have another Static Snowstone and glistering, Glistening Beach Rock. Very cool. Give me a second to get sleeves on all these guys. I'm definitely happy to be getting a good amount of full hollows today. 
And got that one. All right. Moving right along. Still got a few left in here. Quite a few left, actually. Let's just pull them out here. Yeah, we still have quite a ways to go, actually. And we've got a lot of good stuff already. All right, guys. We still haven't seen any of the Supernova 6, so hopefully today we will get one within these last few packs here. All right, there's that level and rocket again. Coming in hot with the pig. Riverside monster, that one's kind of cool. Robot prey mantis thing with a uh, lobster claw, something like that. <laughs> a lot going on there. San Pedro Mountains Mummy. That's kind of cool. What we got. Ooh, look at that. That's a really cool one. Dragons Rise. I love dragons. The dragon cards are the best. That's a great one to get in the full hollow. We'll take it for sure. I will say, like, cards like this, I feel like there actually may be some, like, really solid hits to get outside of the uh, Supernova 6. I don't know. Maybe these are not that valuable or that sought after. But, man, I think that that one was a really cool one. That might be my favorite one so far. That might be my one gripe with Wilderness is I feel like really the only good ones that you could get, it seemed like, were the the wild seven but it is what it is we got another full hollow sparky slushy slushy can't say i quite understand that one let's go again moving through these a little faster now that we've seen a lot of the artworks all right here we go uh drowned sea orb yeah we we got that one already, right? I think so. Okay, Sunset Finality Orb again. This one does not want to open normally for me. Another one of those. Ooh, nice, we got the hat man. That's a cool one too. I like it. Colors remind me of the ghost train. Definitely got a sleeve on him too. Evil wins. Man. Something there. Got the Cryptid Busters again. Who are you gonna call? Cryptid Busters, of course. I like the way that one opened. Hey, Spirit Infusion Suit. Kind of cool. Guy looks kind of like Goku. running out of room with all of our full hollow hits here it's not quite a god box because we have pulled a few reverse hollows but man we have an overwhelmingly large amount of full hollows which i'm not complaining about all right because we're on to our last four or five packs let's slow roll this again hopefully we can still get one of those supernova six today Headless Cannoneer, Lady in Red, okay, Sam's Trusty Baseball Bat, Crawfordsville Monster, Dusk Omen, Reaper Scythe, and another Static Snowstone. I know that this was a very hyped set, I know a lot of people are really excited about it. Um, I'd be curious to know how people feel now that it's actually out. Did it live up to expectations? I'm definitely liking it. I mean, I feel like it's exactly what you come to expect from MetaZoo. 
but like it's uh yeah definitely has the uh the ufo theme shining through with some additional cards on top of that but yeah i definitely see that theme which is cool static halts and reverse pocket dimension orb all right and just like that we're on to our last two packs here oh man last two chances hopefully we can get one of those good cards today i don't know if there's a secret rare to get i'm sure there is but i don't know what that is all right with the dragon's rise cannonball token island cosmic aura charles mill lake monster in Vigorate, Blockheads, Terraforming, there's that Accordion Teeter, you can see a little bit clearer in the non-reverse hollow, very interesting looking, an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, nope, oh. USO, <laughs> man, another Forest Friends, well, man, I said I liked it, but... Do I like it that much to get? I think I got four of them already. All right. All right, and just like that, on to our last pack. Let's get some last pack magic. With the Foo Fighters pack artwork. Starting with the Hat Man. Sheep Token, Lightning Storm, Spirit Aura, Burnout, Headless Cannoneer, Rougarou, kind of looks like a werewolf sort of thing, Space Werewolf, Thunder and Ice with the Loveland Frogman, love to see him in the set, Crawfordsville Monster, Dwarf Star, and today guys we are ending off with... Nope. <laughs> well, didn't mean to to really fake you out that much. All right. Resurrection from the afterlife. Now, for real. This time it's for real. We are ending off with Proctor Valley Monster Full Hollow. All right. Oh man, we got a lot to <laughs> recap from what, our, what we hit today. And we got a lot of full hollows. Pretty crazy. And yeah, guys, for that reason, I did have a lot of fun opening this. Definitely am, am enjoying a lot of these artworks. Some cool stuff in here. Definitely wish we could have gotten one of the uh, Supernova 6, but that just means we're going to have to open up some more product on the channel and see if we can, can get those. Yeah, just a uh, quick recap. That one's cool. That one's probably my third favorite that we pulled. Spirit Infusion Suit, that's a cool one as well. Houston Batman. Forest Friends, a lot one I really like. Evil Winds. Bunch of Forest Friends. Hat Man. I like that one as well. Alright, another Forest Friends. That one was pretty cool too. The Caster Gun. Yeah, guys, I, I like the set. I think it's a good one. Um, will it be the best one that MetaZoo has ever? released i don't know i'm not so sure but it's uh definitely a fun one if you guys get a chance you, they should still have product on the metazoo website and you can also find uh some different uh local game stores that will sell it to you but uh, yeah definitely de recommend you guys checking it out thank you metazoo games for sending me this booster box and if you like MetaZoo and Pokemon card content, check out one of the videos here on screen next. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to support the channel. And lastly, I just want to let you know that no matter what you're going through, you are not alone. God is with you and he loves you and we do too. I'll catch you next time.